Hello everyone and welcome to my Unreal Shadow series. My name is Michael Gerard and I'm technical with Techno Artist. During this course, I will show you step by step how to create a fully customizable water shader. We will start by creating a wave movement with the help of a native item function. After this first feature, we will create the deep water logic to control independently shallow and deep water color. To control the normal, roughness or specular intensities, we will create a peak function with all the parameters. And we will take advantage of this part to implement a distance system to avoid the wave repetition at long distance. Once we have taken control of our parameters, we will focus on opacity to create a smooth transition between the object and the water edges. And we will set up a really simple refraction parameter. To increase the realism of our water, we will see how to generate caustics and foam effect. Fully customizable in color, texture size, intensity, fade distance, and speed. Because it can be really useful in rainy environment, we will look at how to integrate a ripple system. As a bonus, you will find in the course resources the Substance Designer file for creating and or modifying the ripple texture. To add details to the water surface, painting mesh is always a good option, but it's sometimes difficult to simulate the waves on them. With the vertex layer, you can paint all kinds of details on the surface and control the wave's influence. Winter environment have always something special. That's why we will integrate a vertex controllable ice system. Finally, we will set up an option to convert our water point into a river. This course is designed to be accessible whatever your skill level. I show every step and do nothing off the camera. And for the first time in my content, you can follow only the video or access to the source project. If, like me, you are keen to take part of this program, then I'll see you soon.